What do you think is the easiest and most profitable scam going around right now? I'll give you a hint, it's not dating website catfishing. It's actually SIM swap scamming, and it's become a major issue around the world over the past few years. Scammers have defrauded people out of tens of millions of dollars by sidestepping the automation processes of phone carriers and then cleaning out their targets. Yes, the same carriers you are likely using right now. But there's one tech company that's found a solution bringing 11 layers of security and powerful encryption to the humble SIM card. Who is this company and how does their revolutionary product work? Stick around and find out. What is up, everyone? Welcome to Crypto Capital Venture. Please hit that subscribe and like button on the way in because in today's video, we're taking a look at Afani, the innovative telecom company that aims to make SIM swap scams a thing of the past. We're going to take a look at how the scam works and how Afani stops scammers in their tracks. So if you're ready, let's dive in. In 2021, the FBI received 1,611 reports of SIM swap scams in which more than $66 million was stolen as a result. And it's a similar story in the UK where for the past few years, SIM swap scams have cost victims just under 3 million pounds every year. So what exactly is a SIM swap scam and how do fraudsters pull it off? In essence, a SIM swap scam works when a criminal takes control of your phone by convincing your phone carrier to provision your number onto a blank SIM card in their possession. Sounds simple, right? Well, not exactly. If you've ever called your phone company to check a bill or change your plan, you'll know the customer service representative asks a ton of ID questions, or at least they're supposed to, to make sure that you are who you really say you are. Now, this is where the scammer's homework comes into play. If they can contact your provider and supply your name, address, phone number, date of birth correctly, maybe a PIN, they then often have unfiltered access to your account. For some people, it's as easy as stalking the social media profiles of people and copying down the details they've left public. For others who have a greater sense of online security, it can be a little bit more difficult. You see, scammers use multiple methods to steal your private information, including phishing emails, stolen accounts, credentials from security breaches and many many more tactics in other cases no security measures even matter it's sometimes just a matter of persistence and social engineering depending on what rep the scammer is talking to if the phone rep at your phone company is having a bad day that might be all it takes for a scammer to get access to your account once a scammer has your info or access to your account portal, they can request a SIM swap with your number provisioned on a blank SIM that they own. Within minutes of this happening, your phone shows no service and all calls and messages are now being rerouted to the scammer. And from here, that scammer can access all of your online accounts that utilize two-factor authentication when logging in. This includes bank accounts, crypto exchanges, and all your social media profiles. And before you know it, scammers can make purchases clean out your bank accounts, and transfer any crypto to their own wallets. In fact, this scam is so effective, people usually don't even realize they've been defrauded until they're unable to send texts or make calls. And by that time, it's too late. The damage may have already been done. Now, most people these days are fairly aware of scams. We all are. We ignore obvious scam emails, texts, and calls while blocking thousands of bot accounts on social media, begging for our wallet seed phrase. But SIM swap scams can target and fool even the most secure conscious of people. In August of 2019, Twitter users awoke to find a stream of offensive messages and scam links coming from the platform's CEO, Jack Dorsey. Jack had fallen victim to a SIM swap scam and for an agonizing 15 minutes, criminals posted a tirade of awful tweets and advertisements. Jack was fortunate that he was able to regain access and even more fortunate, they did no real damage. Unfortunately for a lot of people, that's not always the case. Phone companies are generally slow to restore service to you and admit no liability to any losses you may have incurred. And I speak from experience when I say that the phone companies do not care about you. So the question is, what's the solution? At its core, Afani is a 5G mobile carrier that piggybacks on the two biggest mobile networks in the United States. But the thing that truly sets them apart from the rest of the competition is their impressive security tech stack and insured guaranteed against SIM swap scams. 
For starters, Afani runs a two-way encryption service, encrypting both your data and all of your communication over the network. Secondly, when it comes to SIM swap requests, Afani's default position is no. Instead, a proprietary 11-layer verification process must be completed before the request will be accepted. You thought two-factor authentication was secure? 11 factor is basically a bank vault inside of Fort Knox. Not convinced? To date, no hacking attempt has ever made it past the third layer of security. Any request made to swap a SIM card or change billing information must be run through a rigorous manual process, which includes independent approval from multiple staff members and the creation of a notarized statement. They also utilize a 14-day cooling off period before provisioning new SIM cards, allowing any potentially compromised users the ability to block SIM swap scam attempts. So how confident are Afani that they can prevent SIM swap scams? Not only does Afani guarantee that Afani subscribers will be safe from SIM swap scams, they offer up to $5 million worth of cybersecurity insurance from Lloyds Bank in London. In the extremely unlikely case of criminals stealing your money through SIM swap scams, Afani will reimburse up to $5 million as compensation. So how do they compare to other US telecom companies in terms of price and performance? Let's start with price. For a postpaid plan that has unlimited calls, texts, and data, most providers are charging around $60 per month. For Afani, you'll only pay $99 per month for the same thing. The only difference is the added security and the fact that you're not locked into any contract. In terms of performance, Ifani utilizes ultra-fast 5G network that covers 99% of the American population. They also offer free Wi-Fi calling so you can make and receive calls in locations with poor coverage. Afani is for anyone that is serious about their privacy and security, but there are some people in professions that were amongst the first to get on board. Afani already services government officials, VIPs, crypto whales, and wealthy individuals who can afford to have their private information accessed and their funds stolen. But who can afford that? No one. Keep in mind that through this, it's not just your bank accounts that you're securing or even your crypto. Theft of intellectual property and or confidential material is a massive problem as well. And you could potentially be vulnerable to losing control or ownership of it. At the end of the day, cell phone and security is a pretty glaring weak link in our otherwise scam-proof lives. So it pays to make sure you're fully protected. The wonderful thing about Afani is that the price for the service is unbelievably affordable, especially when recognizing the risks that it offsets. So that's all we have time for in today's video about Afani, the secure phone company that's committed to the fight against identity theft. And there's really not much more to say, everyone, other than hit the Afani link below and get protected right now. I am, and I know it's worth it. If you enjoyed this video, please let me know by hitting that like button. And if there's anything you think that we missed in this video, make sure to let me know in the comments below. Thank you all for just stopping by, for watching the video. I appreciate each and every one of you. I'll see you in the next video. God bless.